3M SB. 3M True Definition Scanner, step-by-step -step case procedure. This comprehensive tutorial will walk you through each step of creating a digital restorative case with the 3M True Definition Scanner. Some chapters are also available as standalone tutorials from the main menu if you wish to revisit a specific topic. We wish you fun and success in becoming a true digital office. 3M SP Retraction Capsule. Dispense a small quantity of paste onto a mixing pad. Introduce the capsule tip into the sulcus, opening the sulcus. Rinse the sulcus thoroughly with water and dry lightly with air before application of the paste. Isolation. Good moisture control is essential on the lower arch and for this case we will demonstrate some techniques that our trainers recommend. We'll start by inserting two dry tips into the cheek before inserting the Optrigate from Ivoclar. The easiest is to slide both sides simultaneously in the mouth and let the upper and lower rims rest against the teeth before securing the rim in the lip sulcus. Detailed instructions are available on the product wrapping. Hygoformic saliva ejectors shown here work well in isolating the tongue and maintaining a dry field. Powder application. Make sure the prepared area is completely dry before applying powder. Do not pump the trigger. Hold the trigger down halfway to dispense powder in a nice even flow. To lightly powder prep, begin spraying a tooth far from the prep and pass over the prep, avoiding any initial burst of powder. As you can see, the nozzle is missing the lingual surfaces here. Also in this case, the tongue is not isolated sufficiently, and therefore powder is being removed from the lingual surfaces. Always turn the nozzle, and not the powdering device. Preview the preparation. Anyone working with magnified dentistry will realize the importance of seeing the preparation in a magnified view. Select the video camera icon from the left to start a video preview. By previewing the clinical situation before scanning, obstacles like underpowdering and blocked margins can be avoided. Scan Preparation The default wand orientation is the occlusal start position, which means the scan has to be started on the occlusal surface. It is best to scan the prep and contact surfaces first to avoid degradation of the marginal area. After capturing occlusal surfaces, rotate lingual, making sure to rotate a full 90 degrees. Rotate over to the buckle. To capture the interproximal surfaces, it is best to angle the yellow capture area diagonally to the surface you want to capture, as seen here. Stop the scan and review the mesh data displayed on the screen. If there are data holes, they can be patched by a subsequent scan. The next step is to save and confirm your prep in video mode. Review prep in video mode. To add your preparation, select the Add Prep icon on the left of screen. Touch and highlight the center of the prep tooth so that the contact areas in prep are highlighted. Select the correct tooth number from the menu above. Touch the green check at the bottom to confirm your selection. This will bring up the prep video data in high resolution. From the menu on the right, you can select the Margin Reference tool, which allows you to allocate points on the margin in Zoom function. You can also delete any points and select the 3D view from here. Patching Scans To add the rest of the arch, start on a surface previously scanned. Previous scans are displayed on the top left corner. 
Follow the scan path seen in previous tutorials. Before saving data, patch any hole seen immediately. As you can see, the previous two scans are shown on the left, and we can quickly patch the few occlusal holes seen. Scan opposing arch. Start in the occlusal surface of the tooth directly opposite your prep. Only scan the teeth you need for the bite registration. Posterior bite registration. To scan the bite, choose the correct bite icon. In this case, the bite icon for the right side of the patient. The mandibular and maxillary scans should display parallel to each other, but not in occlusion. Before starting the scan, ensure the patient has closed correctly. Scan the gingival margins in either direction. Scan three to five teeth in a rectangle. No need to fill in the holes. Make sure to complete the rectangle. Lab Prescription To complete the lab prescription, select the prescription icon in the lower left corner. Touch to select restoration type, for example, crown. Choose the tooth number or tooth numbers if there is more than one restoration of the same material. From this point, all other information is optional. Do not forget to enter the tooth shade information, as this is also optional. Step-by-step -step overview. This module will show a complete case to help you put it all together.